the total solar eclipse. DFW hasn't seen one since 1878, and another won't happen until after the year 2300. But what is it? Basically, it's a big shadow of the moon moving right over uh, areas of Texas. So the moon generally positions itself between the Earth and the sun, but this time, because of the time of the day that it's happening, it's going to cast a huge shadow over a big portion of North America. And we just happen to be in what's called the path of totality, which means that we will see darkness in the early afternoon. And this passes over Mexico. It passes over a big portion of the US and eventually Canada. Most of the area if we see uh, clear skies will be in darkness, but everyone in Texas should witness at least a partial eclipse, but the Metroplex, most of it under a total eclipse between 140 to 144. Now, unfortunately, because of the weather pattern that we're in, one model showing it completely cloudy around this time, our European model and our American model showing cloud cover at 140 as well. So it's not looking great for us in terms of viewing for the eclipse, but at least it, you'll be able to see it get dark. Um, it's just really unfortunate that we're going to see active weather in an active weather pattern during early next week. Yeah. All right, Mark.